Hey, how's it going? Andy here. Welcome back to the 90s Around. This is show I do here on my channel on Saturday. So if you love the 90s, subscribe. This way you don't miss a single episode. And in today's episode, we are taking a 90s quiz. So this is from playbuzz.com. I'll leave a link down below so you can play too. But uh, I'm going to do this all in one take. This way you guys don't think I'm cheating and looking up answers if I get them all right. So it's all just going to be one take. So let's uh, jump right into this. This is, can you answer the 30 questions every 90s kid should know? Hopefully I can. I might be getting a couple wrong. We uh, shall see. Number one, Britney Spears' first song was, Sometimes, Baby One More Time, You Drive Me Crazy and Toxic. Um, it was Baby One More Time. This was the company logo for Strawberry Shortcake, Beanie Babies, My Little Pony, Troll Dolls. So right now it was for Beanie Babies. What is this toy called? Sloosh Ball, Koosh Ball, or Hooshie Ball. This is a Koosh Ball. They're actually very, very fun. It, okay, it just said I did not click one. Maybe one more time. There we go. Uh, but yeah, koosh balls are actually kind of fun. They're super simple. It's just a fuzzy little ball. It was cool. <laughs> uh, which basketball player was in Space Jam? Michael Jordan, Dennis Rodman, Tim Hardway, Scotty Pippen. That would have been my boy, number 23, Michael Jordan. Mr. Feeney was the teacher in which popular TV show? Fresh Prince of Bel Air, Save by the Bell, Boy Meets World, Beverly Hills, and 90210. Favorite show of all time is Boy Meets World. He is from Boy Meets World. What was Tommy's last name in Rugrats? Was it Finster, Pickles, DeVille? It would have been Pickles. Pickles. Who wrote the book series Goosebumps? Dave. Pelkey, Lois Lowry, R.L. Stein. My boy, R.L. Stein. By the way, if you guys have never seen, or if you guys haven't seen the new Goosebumps movie, I recommend it. It was actually pretty good. Ooh, Dunkaroos. These were my favorite snack of all time. Favorite snack of all time. The original flavor of Dunkaroos cookies was vanilla cinnamon chocolate. Of the cookies. I want to say cinnamon, but I feel like that's wrong. It might have been vanilla. I'm gonna go with vanilla? Damn it! Or cinnamon. I should have known that. Graham crackers. Or cinnamon. Oh well. Got one wrong. Instinct consisted of Justin Timberlake, Lance Bass, JC, Chaz, Joey Fatone, and uh, Jeff Timmons, Joey McIntyre? Sure. Brian Littrell, Chris Kirkpatrick. It would have been Chris Kirkpatrick. What was the boy's name in Pokemon? I don't know. I do not know. Forgot to close my printer. Uh, Polly, Onyx, Ash, Kai. It would have been Ash. Surge. You guys know I love Surge. Uh, what flavor soda was Surge? Orange, grapefruit, citrus. Would have been citrus. Tamagotchi is a Japanese port. I don't. I don't know what that says. Of what two words? Egg friend, egg watch, egg computer, egg pet. I know what the word is, I know what it means, but what's Tamagotchi? I want to say egg pet, but something's telling me egg watch. Because you would have to watch it, make sure it didn't die. I'm going with egg watch. Oh yeah, got it right. This toy is called a Furby Birdie Troll. Would have been a Furby. Which I didn't really like. Furbies, honestly. Ooh, Legends of the Hidden Temple. Well, that's the answer, actually. Uh, the game show where teams competed to find the lost treasures in a Mayan temple was called 
the Maya Maze, Legends of the Hidden Temple, Secret of the Lost Temple. Or Secret of a Lost Temple. Legends of the Hidden Temple. Amanda Bynes got her start on the Nickelodeon TV show of Fabulous Wild Thornberry, Secret Roll of Alex Mack, and all that. That would be all that. You are my fire, the one desire. Are the first words of which Backstreet Boys theme song? Drowning everybody, quit playing games with my heart. I want it that way. I want it that way. I want to apologize for the awful thing. Rocco from Rocco's Modern Life was what kind of animal? Dog, armadillo, kangaroo, wallaby. He is a wallaby. Which company made Oreo O's? Post, General Mills, or Kellogg's? That would have been Post. I think I'm doing pretty good. I only got one wrong so far. And we're almost done. 19. Jagged Little Pill is the album by which singer? Whitney Houston, Mariah Carey, Christina Aguilera, or Alanis Morissette? Uh, Alanis Morissette. In Spice Girls, Mel B was known as Posh Spice, Scary Spice, or Sporty Spice. That would be Scary Spice. These small figurines were called Crazy Bones, Giga Pets, Pogs. Oh boy, okay. It's either Crazy Bones or Giga Pets because they're not Pogs. Um, I want to say they're Crazy Bones. So I'm going to go Crazy Bones. Hell yeah! That's what's up. Is this Beavis or Butthead? That would be Beavis. Fun fact, I've never actually truly watched Beavis and Butthead. Like, I've seen like an episode here or there, but I never actually sat down and watched it. Which of the following was not in Super Mario Kart? Not a player in Super Mario Kart. Toad, Princess Peach, Crash, Luigi. Would have been Crash, because Crash wasn't out yet. White Mystery was the flavor of which candy? Laffy Taffy, Warheads, Dum Dums, or Airheads? That'd be Airheads. I remember, that was like a big thing, too. Who played Clarissa in Clarissa Explains It All? Sarah Michelle Geller, Melissa Joan Hart, Alicia Silverstone, Claire Danes. That would have been my girl, Melissa Joan Hart. Full House took place in which city? San Francisco, Chicago, New York City, or Los Angeles? That would be San Francisco. Waterfalls was a popular song by. All Saints, Destiny Shall, TLC, Salt and Pepper, TLC. What was the name of Ross and Rachel's baby? Lily, Emma, Kelsey, Alexis. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of Friends, but I, I'm something saying Emma, because I I can picture in my head a scene where Ross is saying Emma. So I'm gonna go with Emma. Boom. Who's a genius? This guy. Who made these colorful rainbow school supplies? Lisa Frank, Paul Frank, Fubu, Michael Starr. Well, it's not Fubu or Michael Starr. Or is it Frank? Was it Lisa or Paul? I wanna say it was Lisa. Lisa Frank. I'm I'm a genius. Alright guys, last question. I only got one wrong. That's not bad. Not bad. This game featured three inputs. Bop it, twist it, and what? Pull it, slap it, yank it, push it. Well, it's definitely not yank it. It's not push it. It's not slap it. So it has to be pull it. Boom! Get it right. 29 out of 30. Your boy is good. I am a true 90s kid. Just say. <laughs> You are a true 90s kid. This just kind of proves in a way that uh, I am actually as old as I say I am. And that I am not actually 16. Because a lot of people, I don't remember if I said this in the beginning of the video, but they're like, no way this kid is a 90s kid. He looks way too young. Your boy is almost 27. So, yeah. 
it's a, it's a baby face. But that was it. How well did you guys do on this quiz? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe, leave a comment, give it a thumbs up. And if you would like to help support my channel, I have a Patreon. Link is down below, as well as my Twitter and Instagram. You can be as awesome as Dana Smith. She supports me on Patreon. And you can too, for as little as a dollar a month. With that being said, thank you guys so much again. You guys are awesome. You're rad. See you guys next time. Peace.